Hi everybody, it's Andrew from Launch27, and in this video, I want to show you a new feature that we added that lets you specify whether certain items on the booking should be for um, just one booking or for every booking in a recurring booking series. Just a little background on why we made this feature is that a lot of people were asking for a way to make extras only be for uh, the first booking versus for every booking in the recurring appointment. Um, so I'd like to cover, uh, the extras first, but also this new feature applies to tips and to the price adjustment. So regarding the extras, we added a new setting under general settings right here for recurring bookings. You can see that we have a setting for, um, extras should be applied to all bookings of a recurring appointment or only to the first booking. And by default, it's going to be set to all. Um, but for this video, I want to set it to the first booking only. So um, every time somebody books a recurring appointment, and if they have extras on that appointment, those extras will only be applied to the first booking by default. So I want to save my changes. And uh, next, I want to show you a new checkbox that we added to the booking form where you can let the customer actually decide, you know, do I want them to be uh, these extras to be for every booking or just for uh, the first booking. So uh, I'll show you that right now. Just go back up to the booking form designer. Okay, here I am on my booking form designer. And um, you scroll down, you can see that there's a hidden checkbox, a hidden field here, right? I, if I click that, it says uh, I can make it visible. And it just says, do you want to add these chosen extras to all your future bookings? Um, so whatever they, if they mark, if they um, check the box, that means it will be added to all future bookings. If they leave it unchecked, that means it'll only be for the first booking. So I'll just go ahead and save this. And now I'll go to my form and show you how to create that booking. Okay, here I am on my book, on my booking form. I'm just going to fill it out really quick. I'm going to add both of these and I'm going to leave this blank. I only want them to be for the future bookings. Um, choose a date. And make this weekly and create the booking. Okay, now I'll show you what that booking looks like um, when you try to edit it. Okay, here I am on my booking. And you can see that we have this new button called View Recurring Items. If you click that, you can see that um, these extras are only going to be for this booking only. Now, if I wanted my oven clean every booking, I can just choose that, close that. Um, and now is a good time to show you the price adjustment and the tip. So we've always had a way for you to specify if the price adjustment should be for this booking or for all future bookings. But now we just moved that setting into this uh, recurring items window. And as far as the tip goes, we used to make you, um, tips were only for one booking at a time for the current booking. That means every appointment, uh, staff or the customer had to go in and set the tip. So now you can just set it and set it to be for every booking. So if you click save changes, you see that the system knows if a change is made to the extras to the price adjustment or the tip and it's going to show this window so that you can confirm um, how you want these to be so price adjustment i want it to be for all bookings and tip i also want it to be for all bookings and you can see earlier that when i changed my oven to be for all bookings and then the inside of the fridge is just for this booking so click save so now that when that next booking is created next week all the settings will inherit from what we just set so that's about it. If you have any questions, please let us know at support at launch27.com. Thanks.